welcome to the channel. If you haven't been here before, my name is Langers and I am the Scruffy Trader. And what I'm kind of trying to do is put trading in the real world. Maybe show you a trick or two along the way. So if that sounds good, please click the little subscribe button. It genuinely helps. And if you've got a question, drop it in the comments below. I genuinely answer every single one of them. Now this is a end of night video. I've done a couple of these. And it's an off-the-cuff video as well. In other words, it's it's not planned. I wasn't really going to be doing anything tonight. However, I was talking to some of the guys earlier on. And I marked up the DAX for them. And when I do a markup of a chart, I think it's only fair that I trade it as well. Uh, simply put your money where your mouth is. So to give you a quick idea of what I was looking at and where this has all come from. These are all my support and resistance lines, areas of interest if you like. And you can see a massive drive up. And then it's, it's come back but it's bounced between these two red lines. And it's kind of using the centre line, where it's just off centre, as a pivot point. So I was trying to explain that because of that, and it's a Friday, there's not going to be a lot of activity, but it's going to be a lot of traders looking to take profit, etc. And you can maybe capitalise on that. And the reason being, you see, yesterday there was a, a massive sell-off. And today traders are going to be taking profit. Which if you look throughout from this morning they have now it's retraced it's reacted at this point so i drew in some fib lines just to give me a gauge of what was going on used an 8 ama as a guide drop it into a 15 minute just so that i can have a proper good look at this and sure enough it's respecting this level so what I did, working from level to level, looked at a midpoint, drew in some curious levels that I think could work quite well, and then zoned them out. And there is the zones. And what I'm trying to do is get up into this section here, from the 23 up to the 38. But because it's late, and this has been meandering around since sort of half past four when I sort of did a quick look at this I was hoping for it to slam up quick it hasn't but it's not slamming down either but we are into profit the reason why you see the area staged out initially was going to be looking at getting from here up to there the midpoint if you like between these two zones it came back on itself so as long as it stayed around this area between that line and that line i was happy to enter in a couple more times average in stop just underneath this zone here and then trade it up but it seems to be stalling and sometimes you need to see the bad as long well as the good and it's a good reason as to why I don't like trading on a Friday because the markets are quite erratic but on the other's point of view if I open my mouth I should back it up with a trade and that's exactly what what I'm doing so so there we go uh, I'll just let it run out um, I'm not going to close these off as yet I do think it has a good chance to get here tonight I'm just going to ease that to the top of there reason why I'm easing it there it's a logical stall point here I'm going to pull this order if you bear with me 
we sort of here into the same place. So we've got that order, that order, and then we've got this one, which was the runner. We're going to pull that down to there as well. And the idea is, is to let the, the trade just run itself out. That is it. Okay. If I have to kill it, well, then I'll, then I'll kill it. And that's the trade makeup for this. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to let it play out. It's either going to make me happy or make me sad. And let me know how your day has been today. I've had a, a reasonable day. Um, I shouted cable out earlier. That came in good. Got some money out of that. I just want a little bit extra out of this but it's one of those days that you cannot force the market if it's not there it is not there okay you just have to take what you can give or take what you can get rather so let me run it out I'm gonna enjoy my beer have a shower freshen up ready for having tea and then I'll come back to it. So, see you in a bit, guys. Okay, boys and girls, looks like we are going to close this out in profit, which I am manually going to do right now. Uh, so what I'm going to do is, where are we at? It's 20 past. Let's see if that will edge up a little. Come on, give it a little push. All I'm doing is I'm just kind of seeing if it'll push up into the, that last bit. It's the end of the night, it's 20 past seven. And like I say, I didn't really want to be running this today. Oh, there we go, we're all out. Happy days. So Lang has opened his big gob, as he often does. Um, talking to the guys in the scruff squad and like I say if I'm going to open my mouth I should trade it as well um, it's all well and good saying what you think but trade what you see but also back up what you say so I'll leave it there that is what we've done today this afternoon rather 317 live with that happy stuff so remember guys do what you love and the money will follow see you all next week